Suspension of 12 opposition MPs continues to be a key flashpoint now. After Wednesday's showdown, fireworks are expected once again today. The 12 MPs began day two of their dharna outside parliament over suspension. The suspended MPs have remained defiant, refusing to apologize for August 11 incident. Yesterday, Rajya Sabha Chair Venga and Aidu slammed MPs over ruckus and refused to revoke their suspension. Leader of Opposition in Rajya Sabha, Malikarjun Kharge, earlier in the week, written a letter to Naidu on behalf of suspended MPs, calling the move an unprecedented excessive action. Some opposition parties have even threatened to boycott the entire winter session if the suspension is not revoked. Now, growing concerns if these disruptions with, will cloud the winter session by blocking the key bills. Supriya Bhatwaj is now joining us live for the latest. Supriya, whatever the reason is and whatever is going on between the ruling party and the opposition, the fact of the matter is if this is going to be a washout session again, like the last one, all of this is happening at the taxpayers' money, your and my money, and it is the taxpayers of this country who are going to be suffering if this is going to be a washout session. Well, Chethi, uh, the information which is trickling out from Parliament House is this, that uh, in Lok Sabha, it's going to be business as usual for today itself. Uh, we will be seeing a short duration uh, debate uh, under Section 190 which uh, the opposition parties uh, will be taking part in. Uh, as the entire discussion will be on COVID mismanagement and the new variant which is coming into the scene. At the same time, as far as the Raj Sabha is concerned, we are seeing that uh, there will be some stormy uh, scenes to be witnessed. Uh, the opposition will once again ask the chair to revoke the suspension of the 12 MPs already. The member of parliaments of, from the opposition side, whether from Lok Sabha or from the Raj Sabha, are sitting and staging a protest near the Gandhi statue. Rahul Gandhi is leading that protest along with these 12 suspended MPs and the MPs from the other 16 opposition parties who are raising slogans against the government and saying that at the earliest the government has to revoke the suspension of these Raj Sabha MPs who are just raising the concerns of the people in the house. This is what the opposition is saying at the moment. As far as the Congress is concerned, it's a two-pound strategy. For Raj Sabha is a different uh, strategy and for Lok Sabha it's a different one. In Lok Sabha they want discussion on COVID mismanagement, they want discussion on China, they one discussion on the farm issues as well as MSP and that of uh, the compensation for the farmers who have lost their lives. So we will be seeing some business, some action in both the houses. But as far as the Hangama is concerned or the protests are concerned, that certainly is rocking the parliament inside as well as outside. All right, leave it at that. Thanks so much for joining us with the very latest details right there, uh, Supriya. Uh, we'll continue coming back to you for more on the story.